Hi everyone, welcome to How to Electronics. In this video, I will make three different types of robots by assembling all these parts and mechanical stops. The robot is based on Arduino Mega Board and has so many sensors. The parts are designed for multi-purpose applications and are transformable. The first robot that I'm gonna make is the robot tank, also known as off-road land rider. This robot can run on a plain surface as well as in the rough terrain. Similar to the robot tank, the robot can move forward and backward, left and right. The robot can be controlled using voice commands as well. Hey robot, go forward. Go backward. Stop. Dance. If you draw a line and assign the path of travel, it will follow the path. This can also be used as a line following robot. Similarly, using the ultrasonic sensor, we can use this to make an obstacle avoidance robot. All these functionalities can be controlled using mobile app. The second robot we are gonna transform is a three-wheeled racing car, which is also known as Dashing Raptor. This robot is fast and can be used as a racing car. It also follows line perfectly and can be used as a line tracking robot. The obstacle avoidance features work as well. Like Land Rider, it can also be controlled using voice commands and Go forward Go backward Dance This is the third robot, which is the self-balancing robot, also known as Nervous Bird. This robot remains always level when driving straight or standing still and leans at an angle when making turns. So let's see how we can assemble all these robots and use them for multi-purpose applications. This is the kit called Ambot Ranger from MakeBlog. This is not a sponsored video, rather I purchased it for learning. I purchased this robot recently from Amazon. Amazon Prime Day is coming, so you can get this robot at a huge discount price. Check the link in the description for purchasing this. Let's unbox this and see what is inside. As you can see it has sensors, modules, motors, movable parts, frames, screws, bolts and all other stops for assembly. Don't get panic by seeing all these too many parts. I will explain all of them. This is the main controller of the board built using Arduino Mega 2560. It has sound sensors, light sensors, gyroscope motion sensor. For communication, it uses a Bluetooth module. These motor encoders are for connecting motors. These RG25 ports are for connecting various sensors and modules. This board has a power button, power LED, buzzer, USB connector, reset button and RGB LED ring as well. All these are programmable. This is an ultrasonic sensor HCSR04 module for object detection and collision avoidance. The kit also comes with a line tracking module designed using a light detective sensor used in line tracking. This is a high quality DC motor. Actually there are two motors which are the main movable part of the project that moves the robot. We have some cables and connectors for communication and connecting. This is the battery holder which can hold 6 AA batteries. The batteries are not provided with the kit, you need to purchase them separately. There are three pairs of different types of wheels. 
This is the movable part of the robot used along with the motors. Some frames are also provided for support and assembly. These are made of aluminium and are light weighted. For the Land Rider tank robot, we need a tank like tire and grip. The facility is provided with high quality gripping tires. To assemble all these, we need screws, nuts, bolts and some mechanical assemblers. A description for all these parts and robots is given in this assembly manual. I use this manual to assemble all the robots. You may follow the easy picture or step by step guide and learn completely about the assembly process. Using this guide, you can assemble three different robots like Land Rider, Nervous Bird and Dashing Raptor. Using the manual, first I assembled the tank robot. This is what the Land Rider or robot tank looks like. The rider tank is supported by three wheels. At the bottom, a line follower sensor is attached for line tracking. At the front, there is an ultrasonic sensor for object detection. Now the robot is ready and already pre-programmed. You may start the operations. In the manual, there is a link for an app. You may scan the QR code and download the app. The app can be found in Play Store and also in App Store. Install it simply. Once installation is done, open it. From this interface, select Ambot Ranger. Then select Play button. Then click on the drive. First, we need to connect the robot to the Bluetooth of the phone. Turn on the robot and follow the mobile screen guide. The robot will be soon connected to the app. Once the connection is done, go to the drive option. Using this joystick-like option, control the robot now. There are some other options as well for driving. You may turn on the buzzer also, as well as RGV LED. The robot can be moved in the forward direction, then in reverse direction. This can also be rotated left and right. In case you want to run this robot in rough terrain, remove this line sensor from bottom surface. Place it on a rough area or in grassland and control it with an app. From the app, now go to the draw and run option. In this option, you can assign any path to the robot. The robot will follow the path. For example, my friend has drawn this path in his mobile app. Then he hit the play button. Observe the robot's movement. It is the same path. This is really amazing, right? Go to the third options in your mobile app now. You can turn on the robot into a musician. Using this piano, you can produce piano sound. The robot can play birthday songs and tinkle tinkle songs as well. Go to the voice controlled options now. You can control a robot using the voice command here. Go forward. Hey robot, go forward. Go backward. Stop. Dance. Turn left, turn right. 
The robot can also follow a particular tracker and can be used as a line follower robot. This line follower track comes with a robot kit. Just place the robot on a track and the robot will follow the track. Go to the avoid obstacle option now. In this mode, the robot can be used as an obstacle avoidance robot. Click on the play button here. The ultrasonic sensor will detect the obstacle and will avoid it. It will not allow the robot to move in the forward direction. So that's all about the tank robot or land rider robot. Using this assembly manual, now assemble the other robot called Dashing Raptor, which is also a three-wheel racing car. This robot has two big wheels at the front and a small rotational movable rim at the back. This robot is super fast and has all the functionalities similar to Tank Rider. Go forward. Go backward. Dance. Turn right. Turn left. The third robot here is the Nervous Spot robot. I again use the manual to assemble this. The robot is also called a self balancing robot. The robot appears to be a small and looks awesome. Let's control the robot using the app. The self-balancing feature is great and working pretty well. It can also mimic other functionalities like other robots. That is all from the video part today. The purchase link for the video is given in the description. You can get a great discount on this on Amazon Prime Day. Thank you so much for watching. See you in the next video.